Hello, my name is Dr. Marisa Weiss. I'm president and founder of BreastCancer.org. I'm also an oncologist at Lincoln Medical Center, and I'm a breast cancer survivor myself. Uh, when it comes to breast cancer, most women are diagnosed with relatively early stage disease. Um, some women are diagnosed with more advanced disease, a bigger cancer in the breast, more lymph nodes involved, and some women are diagnosed with breast cancer that's advanced, which means it's gone beyond the breast and the lymph nodes to other parts of the body. Regardless of your situation, there are many treatment options that are effective in your situation. After the breast cancer has been removed in early stage breast cancer, most women are cancer free, but they want to take advantage of this sort of window of opportunity to do whatever they can that's reasonable and effective to reduce the risk of ever seeing the cancer again, which is called a recurrence. So a breast cancer recurrence can happen in the same area where the breast is or had been, in the lymph nodes nearby, or perhaps in other parts of the body. So treatment after surgery is directed at that risk. Um, that can involve hormonal therapy, chemotherapy, targeted therapies, radiation therapy, and sometimes it involves a combination of all of those treatments, all hands on deck. Um, but in your situation, it may only require some of those treatment options in order to give you the greatest benefit and avoid or minimize any associated side effects. And that's always the goal of treatment, is to give you your best treatment overall, which again means giving you the greatest benefit and avoiding or minimizing side effects. And your treatment could be minimal or it could involve multiple specialties. And it's working with your doctor to figure out what can you do to do everything you can that's reasonable and effective to reduce the risk of ever having a recurrence.